Oh, we had one love heart thingy sent. I'd forgotten that these sort of things exist in this Facebook. That's what I love about it. You know, there are so many love and emotions come when you're uh, interacting. And Jamie says, also Facebook and YouTube are making it very difficult to grow these days. Yeah, uh, yeah. For, for me, I don't know. For the life of me, we have over 800, almost 800 or over 800 channels. I'm still counting. Every day, now I've been having uh, live talks almost every day or every other day for two hours, an hour. And so there's so many. We are now up to number 130. And this is number 140 live talks since August 2016 we started this. So there's so many live talks. And many of them were started in the form of lecture about certain specific topics. And then later on, after about, I don't know, uh, uh, 50, 60, 70, or 80 lectures, we started opening up to question and answer. So they have a component of question and answer after a brief lecture uh, later on. But now it's all question and answer because we've had over 800 uh, videos on YouTube, uh, many, many lectures, uh, talked about some of the chapters in the book and so on. So we have really uh, uh, flooded our channel with lots of good material and content. Uh, and now we have 800 videos, we have continuous live talks, and I still wonder <laughs> what do we have to do to have that four or five hundred thousand subscribers to make this whole thing a, a way of life. Because as you know, and as I'm sure you all have told me, and you can see, I love this helping you guys. At the same time, there has to be economic viability to it, which we're hoping to achieve uh, without uh, having to cost subscribers. But the number of subscribers, then that will help us to be visible and achieve our economic goals as well on YouTube. That's where the dilemma is. So anybody has a good idea, come up. Or in the meantime, I think the best policy would be if you guys share the videos that you like on your social media, talk about it with your friends, and you know, get us visible, whether it's on Facebook, watching my videos, or on YouTube. Go on YouTube, check it out and click that bell thing to let you know every time we have a new thing coming up. So at least you will constantly watch the videos rather than waiting for the, any event on, on, on um, Facebook page alone. I think if we cut every single question and answer and topic that we discussed on the live talks, we will have by itself, we will have about 1500 new videos. So instead of people going through the whole two hour watching it, there'll be one question, one answer video, which I've tried to do most of it, but it's not most. It's only, I think I've done maybe 30 or 40 of them into small videos and they're just fantastic because now you've got a ton of different um, uh, subjects and topics. You just key in certain words and you'll see there's talks about it. But um, eventually if I have enough time, enough justification to allocate more time, I can do all that as well because that would be a pleasure. And Marsha, hello Marsha. Marsha says, I just watched you on YouTube and came here. Oh, that's cool then. <laughs> Thank you for your help. I recently had a breakup and your pebble advice helped greatly.